everybody, welcome to the next game that I'm going to play, which is the co-op campaign of Shogun 2 Total War, and I'm going to do this with Shai Halu. Howdy, guys. And um, I'm very excited for this, because I've been wanting to play this game co-op for a long, long time, but I could never actually find a uh, co-op partner uh, to do this with, and I had Trex actually originally planned, but he died, and I was very glad that Shai actually... Uh, was also kind of into this game. Uh, have you ever played any Total War games before? Oh yeah, Ro uh, but basically all the older Total, Total Wars I'm familiar all the Total with. War. Yeah, uh, medieval, Roman. I asked before, but I about. thought the viewers might wanna wanna know. So um, this is kind of new. So we're playing on hard. Uh, this is, by the way, Rise of the Samurai. I wanted, I thought it would be fun if we would go through the DLC first, since it's uh, historically chronological, chronologically correct, and then we do the main game. Uh, of showing to Total War, and then we'll end with Fall of the Samurai. So, in terms of historic correctness, we are doing it right. Um, so, yeah, we have Long Campaign, which means we have 60 provinces, turn time unlimited, blah, 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 uh, unit size ultra. I am the Kamakura uh, Minamoto clan, and you are the Kiso Minamoto clan. And uh, let's do this! I'm excited. All right, I'm going to leave all the uh, name pronunciations to you. All right, sure. Um, <laughs> all right. There is though, uh, I've never, like I said, I've never played this uh, co-op campaign, but I have seen videos. There's, it's actually very rare on YouTube to see two-player campaigns of this game, so I think we're doing pretty good with this series, and I hope people will like it, because, like I said, it's pretty rare. But, there's a lot of waiting involved. It is turn-based, and it is not actually at the same time, so when your turn is, I need to wait. When my turn is, you need to wait. So, there's a lot of waiting and watching what the other does, but I'm a big, oh, huh? big fan of the Total War games, and I like it a lot. I like the uh, huh? turn-based element as well. So you know, mm. uh, basically like turn turns in pairs. Nah, uh, never mind. Uh, anyway, this is also a 99% blind let's play for me. So I'm gonna quick start. Yeah. Good for, to go. Yeah, let's go. For me as well, by the way, because um, though I I own Rise of Samurai, I've never played it. Because I wanted to do that uh, co op. 3, 2, 1. Let's do this. Yep. It's gonna be a long series, though. I mean, it, though it's a DLC, so it's a little shorter, but usually, you know, the campaigns last up to 40 hours. <coughs> Did you get the uh, extra blood DLC? No, that is one of the most dumb DLCs ever. I've been thinking about buying oh, it, though. I'm insulted. But I it's like <laughs> one, 160 for adding blood. Really? Well, it's it's more animations as well. True. Basically, but it's um, also I mean they're wearing armor, they're wearing plate armor, and it's like yeah. blood as if it's Kool Aid coming <laughs> it, out of them. It, it, it's the Are you still there? But yeah, I'm here. Oh, you were cutting out. Did I cut off? Oh, yeah. Sorry. Okay, the blood DLC is not as great as it looks. Yeah. All right, so, so this uh, is me. Your turn. Me. All right, so you have no control, so you need to watch me here. Um, I am here. You are over here. Uh, you have one town. I have one as well. I actually don't have any sort of assignment yet. Uh, I have my place. one army here. Oh, uh, I can't actually see you. Yeah. Oh, no, there you are. So I have there two places. Um, one thing I always like to do with um, the Total War games, and what's important is to actually establish a a good economy. So usually the first few turns, I set up, you know, trade stuff, uh, make a road so that the trade will be well. Oh wow, I actually cannot fucking build roads because it's too expensive. Um, I can make pastures though, which plus 200 wealth from farms, so I will do that. It's different here than in uh, Rome Total War, that in Rome Total War you could build everything that you wanted, just if you had enough money. Here you actually need to make choices, because you have, because you have certain slots that you can oh, actually... Oh, that's cool. Yeah. Uh, I will also make a harbor for, of course, trade overseas. It's always good. And then I don't have a lot of money. Uh, one thing, but I will explain that when you are, it's your turn, in the bottom right corner, you have, like, Mastery of Arts, or the shortcut for that is M, 
And that's basically your skill tree, which gives you perks and upgrades, which is very important. The tutorial missed that part. Yeah, no, okay. I mean, when I played gotcha. this game, I, I, I learned that like 20 <laughs> waves in, I was like, oh shit, okay. So how do you get these? What, the perks? Yeah. Uh, basically, oh, you. It says it's per turn. Yeah, it's per turn. Like, like uh, the first perk, like the perk that I chose, uh, gives me plus four to diplomatic relations and increase the trade income uh, by ten percent. But it takes two turns to do that, and then the more you go down the tree, the longer the turns take. Um, so I have here. What? What? Who is this? A. Uh. Uh, yeah, you got an agent down there. Yeah, I don't know what his what his role is though. He's new. Left click to select. Double left click to show more details. What the fuck do you do? Huh? What do you do? I, I don't know. I can I can send him here though. Yeah, it's one thing I noticed. They don't really explain things too well. No, that's people who aren't like very familiar with like Japanese culture and that kind of stuff. Yeah. I'm gonna find myself lost a lot. Oh, yeah, yeah. I, can, I can tell the difference between like swords guys, sword guys, and a uh, you know pikemen. Well, you you think like uh, bow samurai would have swords on them? They, they do. Don't. No, no, so, they do. Yeah. But well, oh. mine did. Oh, <laughs> but, <laughs> but were they samurais? Did they have like the triangle hats, or did they have samurai armor? It said bow samurai as their name, and they oh, got really? cut down by horses. Huh? <laughs> they wouldn't pull out their swords. <laughs> 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 they got so surprised. Maybe maybe that know. animation is not in the blood pack. Maybe there's no, no, no swords for it. DLC. Remove content. <laughs> Remove content. <laughs> oh, shit. That's the new thing, man. Don't give them ideas. Yep. So with the agent, I can actually go into other people's territory that I'm in peace with without any problem. But if I, chose, if I choose my army and go into one of their territories, then I need to declare war or request military access. I'm not going to do that. Uh, oh, I'm pretty much cool. done. I'm just gonna uh, check the diplomacy if I can maybe set up some trade stuff. Um, <laughs> I mean, my clan is allies. Is you? None of any other allies. Uh, cannot trade. Cannot trade. Can trade. Uh, how do I request trade again? How the fuck do I do that? Uh, oh yeah, here. So double click, and then request trade degree uh, agreements. Make proposal. Ha! Okay, trade partners. I'm actually not trading with you. I need to ask you to trade. How do I do that? Where are you at? I don't know. Here. I heard about you guys down there. Yeah, actually, don't I cannot trade. Your crap. Um. <laughs> oh, we probably have to. We probably have to like connect the empire or something. It's yeah. Going. Uh, I can trade with one. Well, maybe you. Well, like in the past, you'd have to have like a trade agreement with the surrounding country so you could send merchants through them to get yeah. somebody else. It's also you, you need you need a port, right? You are in you are in the middle of the country, so you actually don't have a port. So, uh, so why would I need? No, you could do by a road. I know you can also, but uh, that's weird. My road's not good enough for you. <laughs> <laughs> I couldn't buy roads for me. I needed more money. I'm I'm poor. <laughs> It, this is weird though. Like there are clans that I'm indifferent with and friendly with, and then there's one clan. Like I'm friendly, for example, with you, but then there's this one clan called Takeda, w to which I'm very friendly with. It's the only one that I'm very friendly with. It's pretty weird. So I'm gonna ask for a trade agreement and request an alliance since we're very friendly. All right, where'd you find the uh, trade clan uh, trade menu? Uh, you need to press diplomacy, which is, I think, K. Uh, okay, I can't do that yet. Okay, well, I'm done anyway. Uh, I did all my stuff. Uh, so I will end my turn. <coughs> and now it's your turn, I think. I think I still can yep. move. Alright, so look at my agent. I'm glad you go first. Makes me look less like an idiot. <laughs> I'm going to send him down to you. So yeah, that agent can actually go into other territories, and uh, without alerting them. All right, he's going down to you to set up some uh, trade agreements. All right. He's 41 though. Your uh, your agent. 
I don't oh, know how if he old dies people before are. he gets there. I'll yeah. <laughs> <laughs> uh, let's see. Where are you? I wish you would put your player name down there. Yeah, true. I know that I you're the yellow beast, though. It's pretty easy. Oh, shit. Wow. Are you asking me to trade? Because the, my, I'm demanding payments. My trade window uh, <laughs> came up. Uh, see, I don't have any options to send to you. Oh really? Oh, that's a shame. Because I can actually, I can like, I can like uh, accept or deny or come up with a counter proposal. Oh yeah. Yeah. Counter propose. Uh, there, you this. offer me to pay, like you give me money. What? No. Why would you do that? <laughs> <laughs> Where are my demands? <laughs> oh, okay, it's an option. <laughs> Yeah, dude, it, I mean, okay. that, that's what I love about this game. I mean, the real-time battles are really strategic, but this turn-based thing, you can also play it really strategic with, with diplomacy oh, yeah. and trade and everything. I love it. I can't test it as real-time battles. <laughs> Normally, in Total War, you just send your guys out. <laughs> nope. Yeah. <Get> <laughs> All right. All it's right. actually, we should, um, because that was the big thing with Rome Total War, is that if you read, like, strategic battle books or battle guides you can actually use some of those strategies to your advantage like flanking and stuff what attendance alpha shot troops I can out a Livy well how, how familiar are you, are you with these like units uh, not at all in uh, in rise of in rise of the samurai they're pretty much all new but basically um, since it's because that, that's a big thing with Rome Total War, right? It's all these different countries, so the units are quite different. But because this is Japan itself, all the units are kind of the same. So, you know, it's it's pretty much the same. I think you also, also know that, like, you know, pikemen are good against horses. Uh, bowmen are pretty weak against pretty much everything. Uh, but, you know, they, they attack from a distance. Uh, horses beat swords... And, uh, yeah. Alright. <coughs> I kinda zoned that when you're talking. Sorry. <coughs> oh, yeah, no. It's alright. Can we, uh, build watchtowers? Oh, what? Okay, so what is this field stuff? Uh, where are where, where, where you watching? Next to your agent? Upper right. Upper right. Right to North Shinano. It's a clickable field here, and I think I could build stuff. Uh, oh, is that the stuff I already built? Like, I can see that you are actually in uh, in uh, Shinano. You, you are building the bad barter exchange. Oh, okay, that's cool. Okay, so the stuff you build actually shows up on the map. Oh, this thing, you mean? The the field's average soil. Yeah. Mm hmm Okay, um, I think I'm good to go. I'm ending. All right. Wait, let me set taxes. Oh, uh, press M for the... Or did you do that? The Master of Arts? It was already set. Oh, you, oh, you can... Do, okay. Yeah, I can actually also click that while... Um, I'm... Uh, while I'm watching you. I'm Master of Arts. Oh, that's pretty, have... pretty cool. My clan actually comes with the first two on the left side, on the Budo tree, it comes automatically with it. Pretty cool. Yeah, I, I had a couple that came with it. Yeah. Oh, I love it. So many clans. It's, it's so cool. Some people really don't like it because there's so many clans and there's so much going on, but I love it. It's kind of hectic and a little bit overwhelming, but I want that full experience. There are even pirates. Do you uh, think the DLC clans would be like in this? I don't know. I know like, that collectible? the DLC clan or the the clans are for the main game, and I don't know how it is for Rise and Fall. I think Fall of the Samurai has actually some um, some uh, clans that that are DLC, but uh, otherwise, I don't know. There's something cool about the the fall of the samurai though is that they have a mode where if in a real time battle like that is the um, 
the last samurai period, right, with Tom Cruise. So basically, they have guns and 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 uh, cannons. So you can get on a Gatling gun and control it real time or aim real time and fire in the battlefield. It's pretty cool. All right, so. What am I doing? Uh, my money is doing okay, construction-wise. Dude, I want to build roads, but still not enough for fucking roads. I mean, everybody's getting blisters in me. Uh, town watch. Plus five in prison of province. I don't. I don't need to. You can also set taxes, by the way, in uh, yep. stuff. But yeah, you already knew that, of course, from uh, Rome. Uh, what do we fear? Barter exchange. You did what you did, right? Each economy chain building and two hundred wealth from commerce. What do we got here? Bow warrior monks. All right, school. No. Uh. Yeah, I'll also do a barter exchange. Uh huh. Uh, I'm not gonna make a bigger army yet, though. I'm gonna go with this guy. Okay. Any new diplomacy stuff that I can do? Come. Nope. I can also only. Yeah, that's pretty handy. <laughs> that's you. <laughs> or is that me? <laughs> I don't know. I you, you, your shoulder pads are huge and clipping through your body. Been playing World of Warcraft too. <laughs> <laughs> um. Yeah. Okay. No new new diplomacy stuff that I can do. So. Uh, I think I'm already done. Uh, yeah. So one thing that is kind of new here, or well, it's not new for uh, Shogun for the Total War Rebirth. What was different in Rome Total War is that um, in Rome, to uh, Rome Total War, you had to go back to one of your towns to replenish your squads, right? To get them back to full strength. Here, if they are in a province that you own, they will replenish a um, part of their army over time, each turn. So you don't actually need to be in a, a city. That's good to know. Wait, no, you need, you need to have like a building for it. Yeah. Uh, and also, uh, do you see, for example, on your city or any cast castle town, do you see those gray bars? Like, you have one yellow bar and you have three gray bars. Now three yellow bars and three gay... Okay. Three gray bars. That's alright, man. My bars <laughs> are gay. It's okay. Basically, those are stock units that will protect that city, even if you don't have any units in it at all. Oh, that's cool. Yeah. And it will become more over time. Uh, so, uh, that's good if you're stuck I'm in broke. that situation. Yep. Uh -oh. Me too. How much money do you have? I think I need to demand money from you. <laughs> that, <laughs> nice. I got like a hundred gold pieces left. I have a little bit more, yeah. Oh, okay. So it's not um that little hourglass up at the upper right for the mastery of arts. That's the time it takes to research. Yeah, and it will automatically actually already <laughs> search something else if it's done. Oh, that's not. So cool. if you I don't forget. Know if well, at least if you forget something, it will add, it, it will not actually not research anything. But yeah, I mean I don't know what you. Right. I mean, do you want to go north? We were talking about this before in the in the, in the menu. Okay. Like, do you want to get get northeast? Well, I was going to sack that Kai place. All right. That way we're connected. It'd be like a quick road to you. Oh, here? <laughs> those, those are the guys I'm very friendly with. Alright. Oh, uh, okay. So I, I think I'll go walk the other way then. That's alright, though. They're they're to my west, though, as well. Wait, uh, they have two places? Yeah, more. They have... Uh, you can probably uh, wait, see it, who too. Are these guys? They're Takeda. That's, that's, yeah, Takeda. Where? I don't see them. Like, you have Kai, which is where you at. If you go southwest, they have uh, Suruga. That they do. No, that's Kajiwara. Oh, yeah. It's okay. Totally Fuck me. That. Yeah, okay. No. I'm, I'm I was going to take these guys and I'm going to uh, explore up north. Alright. 
Can I uh, do anything? 